Good morning, Skeggle Pop. How was your night in your cot? Amazing. Did you love sleeping in there? You want to do it again to, tonight? Yes, yes I'm doing it again. Here's your pussy cat. She's, a, she's alive. She's alive. What? I've been up here before. Oh, she must have moved on her own. No, she's on there. She must have moved all on her yeah. own. Well, I didn't even know. Did she have a nice sleep too? Yeah. In the night, she kept, I put the cover on her when it was nearly morning and she moved the cover wasn't on her anymore. <gasps> That's very cheeky, isn't it? Yeah. She must have been too hot. Yeah. Good morning, guys. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 18 and London Day number two. We're all just up and dressed and we're about to head into London for some epic winter fun. But before we do, it's my brother's birthday today. So we're gonna give him a quick FaceTime and sing him happy birthday. You ready, girls? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Oh dear, he didn't answer. Should we record him a video instead? Yeah. Yeah, we'll record him a video instead. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Yay, we hope you have a wonderful day, bro. We love you lots. Happy birthday. <laughs> is so pretty yeah. it's what Isla nearly bigger than the world yeah. <laughs> we just got here and it's busy there's a big queue but I think it's just for bag search and there is four lanes open, so hopefully it won't take too long. What did you order, Izzy? Cheese and bacon pretzels. Thank Ooh, you. Yum, yum. <laughs> The atmosphere here is so cool. All the music playing, smells of gorgeous food cooking everywhere. Whoa! That man is huge! But it's much too strong. So we're just on the hunt for some lunch. Isabel's chosen a bacon and cheese pretzel. She's been going on about having one of them all week. And uh, Sarah and I are just on the hunt. I think Sarah's after some noodles. You've seen some woman with a really nice noodle dish. You know when, <laughs> you know when you're just wandering around and then you see someone with a food and you really envious. So noodles look so juicy, and now I need noodles. I need them. I've just I seen a, them. I've seen a churros lady over there. Churros stall. Ooh, daddy. Yeah, that's dessert sorted. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm going to go for a massive German hot dog today. The other side. 
right and the left. Yeah. They look amazing girls. They're not hard either, they're like nice. Really soft. They're proper crap stars. Ayla, that looks so yummy. Banana. Banana. Yum yum. Me and Sarah couldn't resist getting one too. Oh, the fellow banana bad boys. <laughs> Nine. Oh my lord, <laughs> scary woman. <laughs> This place is so nice here today guys, usually we get here and it's so busy that you can't move so we're kind of like, ah get me out of here, let's leave but today it's so chilled, there's not many people, yeah, I mean there's lots of people busy, here but it's yeah. not overwhelming, yeah. usually is. it's the space to walk, it's like, it's just super lovely, it's really Christmassy <laughs> and we've got so lucky with the weather here again this weekend, it's just one of those lovely dry crispy winter days crispy winter day. yeah one of them days you just don't mind being outside it's not too cold it's not wet it's not windy it's just lovely and this is just so christmasy we're currently looking for santa land we're going to go visit santa and see that we've kind of seen a few signs saying it's this way so fingers crossed we're going the right way but that's the good thing is that this place is so massive big What did you choose to go on? Ew, you want... so Isla, are you going on the swings? <laughs> How excited she is. You have to hold her, Isla. You have to keep hold of her. Is your cat going on too? Good girl, Isla. Are you ready, Isla? Crazy. 
crazy. Esme. You crazy? Was that good? Yeah, I got it again. You look so high. What does it feel like up there? Quick, go around and come round. I got you. Yeah. Yeah, my favourite. Yeah. Stop it. The chicken mix here are so cool. It's like normal chicken mix, but giant. So, for example, the fried egg. Yo. And look what I just got. <laughs> <laughs> what? We had such a fun time in the Winter Wonderland. We're just leaving Walking now. In the Winter Wonderland. <laughs> <laughs> it was so much fun this year. We've never actually enjoyed that place until this year. We did loads of rides. We met so many of you guys. Thank you so much to everybody that came up and said hi today. Yeah. A special hello to Chloe and Alexia on your birthday. Yeah, happy birthday, Alexia. He was Not so Chloe's lovely. Birthday. It wasn't Chloe's birthday, so I like just giving her a special hello anyway. <laughs> yeah guys, thank you so much to everyone that came up and said hi. It was so lovely meeting you all, especially Aliyu Alexia. So happy birthday, have a lovely day today. So it's just going up to Harper's Four and we're going to do the obligatory touristy London thing right now. We're just walking down towards Buckingham Palace. We're going to go see the palace and take some pictures in front of the gates. Now that I have finished fighting with Isabel, <laughs> play fighting of course, I just want to say we had an awesome, awesome time at the Winter Wonderland, but I am absolutely disgraced at some of the prices that they charge there. It's actually insane. There was a roller coaster, like a mini type one for children, small children, like Isla could go on it. On it. And <clears throat> I said, oh my gosh, we can all go on that one, should we do it? And it was £26 for a two minute ride. £26. That's insane. Also, all the other rides were like four and five pounds each. They literally last like 
a minute and a half and I just think for like a family that's just a crazy amount of money I understand that if people are going to pay it they're going to charge it but I just think it's such a shame that bigger families with more children maybe have to miss out because it's just unrealistic to expect everyone to be able to afford £5 per child per ride. It's insane. Sarah and I were just discussing how cool it would be to live in Buckingham Palace and we were just saying I reckon at least I've got a floating head at the bottom of the screen I reckon at least 40% of the rooms in there are just like dump rooms like are not decorated nicely and they're just like you know them closet rooms that you just throw everything in What he actually rooms, said was there. there'll be so many gadgets I bet the Queen like has a breakfast flown to her from a drone She probably does in the no, nice room. it's the Queen that lives there, babe, not Inspector Gadget. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon there's probably a lot of rooms in Buckingham Palace that are not used and are not beautifully decorated. I'm sure there's most of them are beautifully decorated. But I bet there's loads in there that are just dump rooms. Wow, that's so awesome. It's so big. All the gates are open. Yeah. The gates are open right now and all the roads blocked off, as you can probably see, lack of cars. Yeah. Like the whole road, it's like silent, it's eerie around here. The gates are open and there's policemen stood there with big juicy machine guns. Yep, yep, so yeah. I wonder if someone's coming or going. Oh, daddy. I wonder. I literally just got so excited. I was like, oh my gosh, we're going to see the queen. I wonder who that would have been. I don't know. But he, the police knew him. He, he rocked up and, he, and he, he just, it wasn't like a long thing where a security check. He just went, oh yeah, go on, mate, off you go. <laughs> oh, go on, mate. That's what he said. He go went, on, all right, mate. go on, mate, off you go. Oh, I'm not the gate. The gate's just up now. Oh, that is what they were waiting for then. Oh. <laughs> we're all getting really excited. I bet it was just like, it was actually um, the Queen's kebab takeaway. Probably was the takeaway. Oh, yeah, that's what it was. It was the takeaway, man. She's been on Just Eat. <laughs> The Queen's been on Just Eat, it was a takeaway man. Oh <laughs> Delivering a donut kebab. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, I've got an image in my head now of the Queen just sat there tucking into a cheesy chip. With TV on. <laughs> Do you reckon she'll have chilli sauce or just mayo? Right guys, it's time for obligatory touristy pictures outside of the gates and then we're going. It's time to go and venture on from here. We're going to Covent Gardens next. <laughs> the cutest thing ever that's actually made my day there was a family on the tube that we weren't getting on we were just stood on the side waiting to get on the tube and they saw us obviously it was one of our subscribers they recognized us and waved and then they got off the train just to come and say hello to us guys so they actually left the train that they was on to come and say hello and then they waited with us we had a nice chat and then we all got on the next train and it was so so sweet isabel and her family thank you so much that's literally made my day isabel was very excited weren't yeah. you she got to have a nice chat i was saying how nice it was because usually our subscribers when we meet you guys it's kind of a quick hello and bye bye quick picture and then off they go but we got to actually sit down and chat with them and Isabel found out she liked English at school just like you yeah. so it was super really yeah. nice I'm on the same age yeah and the girl was called Isabel and she was 11 me so it's awesome I'm so glad we got to meet them I just saved my night thank you guys so much for coming to say hello to us we are now just walking through Covent Garden it's so so pretty around here so many nice looking shops and all the Christmas lights it just looks so pretty now the girls have been wanting to go to Five Guys 
burger and fries. <laughs> For ages. We've never taken them there before. Me and Chris have only ever been once and that was when we had our dinner, date, shopping trip in Leeds a few weeks back. And I was explaining how I can't say five guys without saying burger and fries. So if that gets a bit annoying, sorry guys. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to kind of surprise the girls, so to speak, with five guys for dinner this evening. However, after those ginormous crepes at the Winter Wonderland, I don't think anyone's going to be very hungry. But we do need to eat because after this, we're going back to the hotel for a little chill out. My legs are killing so bad. And I think Esme's are too. She's jumped in the pram with Isla. And so they're both in the pram being pushed by Chris right now. Isabel's feet are definitely hurting as well, but she's been a trooper. She's a big girl. Who's hungry? Me. Who wants? Who wants to go to Five Guys? Let's go! Yeah. Ooh, we're just rocking out some Five Guys. Yeah. This is Isabel's first ever Five Guys, and Esme's, and Isla's. So Sarah and I went for obviously the big BC, the double with pretty much everything in it. I don't get mushrooms in mine, so mine's minus the mushrooms. What have you got in yours? No, I didn't get mushrooms. No mushrooms. I've got hot sauce in Hot sauce in mine. Oh, hot sauce in mine today, guys. Woohoo! That was a super, super gorgeous five guys. We're all just leaving now with full bellies. We're gonna head back to our hotel. So we'll see you there, guys. out from our last night of this awesome awesome trip and then tomorrow night has been an adventure tomorrow night we will be ending the vlog at home but we will be back with our pretty who we FaceTime every day this week we've just spoke to her on the phone now that sounds hilarious <laughs> but she definitely recognizes our voices because she starts licking the phone. And sniffing it and going. <laughs> and getting, definitely and getting. Head, like... Yeah, definitely getting excited. It's the first time we've ever left her because obviously we only got her at the start of May and it's we've all so missed hard. her so much, haven't we? It's so hard leaving it because of the puppy dog outside. I know, I got the cutest present today too. Oh, it's <laughs> so cute. It. But yeah, we're almost at our hotel right now. So <laughs> we're going to end the vlog here. We decided to walk home from the tube station. There is a bus. Two went past us. <laughs> it's around a mile and a half walk. And obviously we've not done enough walking today. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> not. No, but we, oh, no, but we needed to work off that burger and fries. So that's why we walked. Burn off some calories. Burn off some calories. So anyway, back at the hotel just about. We're going to end today's vlog here. We hope you've all enjoyed this amazing adventure we've had and coming along with us. We've enjoyed sharing it with you so much. Yeah. Despite the few mishaps we had with the camera. <laughs> if you liked this video, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And we will see you all back at home with our little Prinny tomorrow. Night, guys. Bye. Bye. this video comment and subscribe bye guys hello everybody so i'm so happy that i got a chance to end this video and i just wanted to have a fab christmas and love you